Salutations to people who watch things on the internet. It's been a little while, but I'm back uh, because it's CSA day. It's it's technically Thursday, uh, December 15th, but I got my box on Wednesday. Uh, it's like 2 o'clock in the morning. I don't even know what what I'm doing up filming this. Whatever. Uh, but we got a brand new CSA box. Um, you can uh, go check out down below in the, the box down below if you want to get your own. I think it's like 10 bucks off for your first time if you use the code that's down there. So totally worth it if you live, I think, pretty much anywhere in Southern California or L.A. area. So this week, uh, got some carrots going on. Always good for soups or stews or whatever. Just one of the three parts of Miroquois. Uh, let's see, what else? We got some leeks. More leeks. A couple weeks ago, um... Got a big fat bunch of leeks, and I made some potato and leek soup. So this time I think I'm gonna try to do something different with the leeks. So if you have any like new leek recipes, leave them below in the comments because uh, I don't feel like doing potato and leek soup again. Little baby bok choys again. Uh, those are always just great for stir fry, whatever. Put them in some soup. Uh, big fat bunch of spinach here. Just chop that up and uh, garlic and lemon in a pan, saute that off, and then let's see, a big old bunch of red lettuce. It's always good. Yeah, lettuce. Smells good. Uh, let's see, for the fruit part, let's see what we got down here. Oh, then we, we got a little more veg, a uh, little squash. I think this is a, I think it's a butternut squash. Let me check the paper. Let me check the paper. Uh, yeah, a little butternut squash. Slice that open, uh, a little olive oil, salt, and pepper in the oven for like half an hour, and you're good by itself, or for a soup, or for a ravioli if you want to get creative, whatever. Like, um, got some oranges going on, a couple navel oranges. Uh, looks like we got some apples. I don't know why I said apples. And some lemons, which we have in our backyard, so more lemons, the merrier. Um, some tangerine possibly going on and then finally a little bag of red potatoes for roasting uh, slap those in the oven with garlic and salt and pepper and olive oil and rosemary and thyme or whatever else you want to put on it so always interested to see what I get in my CSA box it's always fun just to support local organic uh, agriculture and eat better because I'm tired of eating fast food so We'll see what I come up with these recipes, uh, and then my actual garden is coming along really well. I don't think it's going to be quite ready till mid to late January, but uh, it's it just sprouted up like nothing over the last couple weeks. So, lots of ideas going on there. Just got to consume all this fruit and veg. I try not to waste it. Usually the fruit goes bad because I'm just not as good about eating fruit as I should be. So, uh, hit the subscribe button. Uh, the last CSA we'll throw down there and I'll throw some other videos maybe over on this side. Uh, follow me on Twitter at Andrew Seeley and I don't know, we'll see. At least in another two weeks I'll have another uh, CSA vlog and we'll see what else I come up before then because if you don't know, uh, YouTube, blah blah blah, AdSense, they don't like me. Uh, we'll put that one down there and you can see why I'm not posting as many videos. But uh, CSA, so there you go. That's the box for this week. And I will be eating some good food. And uh, don't forget to go check out below if you want your own CSA box. And we'll see you guys later. Adios.